Midjourney is by far one of the best AI image tools we've seen recently. But if you've ever tried using Midjourney to generate images and didn't get the exact results you were expecting, this video is for you. In this video, you will learn how to get accurate renders. You can generate the exact kind of images you want with the right Midjourney prompts, formulas, and tips. Of course, you can use these prompts for other AI tools if you wish. Welcome to TechTuned, your AI-focused YouTube channel, where we unravel the latest trends and provide insightful tutorials on the fascinating world of artificial intelligence. So, let's get started. As with any AI tool, getting the perfect output starts with the prompts you provide. A prompt is a command that Midjourney interprets to generate an image. Midjourney prompts can be as simple as a single word or phrase, or as complex as even three sentences that contain parameters for styling. Single phrase prompts work to a good extent, and if you're not looking for something specific, you can work with them. But if you are aiming for details or an exact representation of what you have in mind, single phrase prompts just won't be enough. To generate amazing and creative images from Midjourney, you will need the right prompt. A prompt comprises of up to four elements. The command, the image URLs, a text prompt, and parameters. The image URL and parameter components are just advanced features that can help you with details. The perfect Midjourney prompt. After spending hours trying different prompts on Midjourney, I've put together some fire prompts to get amazing and creative outputs. The perfect prompt should strike a balance between specificity and creativity. To generate a stunning image, the main thing is the subject of what you want. It could be a human image, an animal, a musical instrument, a house, whatever it is. I think this is something most of us already know. The next thing to do is add a feature to your subject. If you're going for a house, a vague prompt like a castle may not yield an image with the specifics you want. Adding a feature makes your prompt more specific and less open-ended. For extra details, you can add an activity to the feature. With these fundamentals in mind, a prompt like a serene castle by the forest, dry leaves and wildflowers, wind blowing, is more likely to produce something stunning and specific. Another thing a good prompt should consider are elements, such as style, mood, theme, color palette, and any specific visual element. Clearly define these elements for a more accurate and personalized output. The formula for a stunning mid-journey output. Midjourney can effortlessly produce mind-blowing outputs with the right formula. Here are three Midjourney formulas you can leverage to streamline your creative process and generate appealing images. Number one, image enhancement formulas. These formulas are for parameters like the brightness, contrast, saturation, and sharpness of the image. With these formulas, you can improve the quality and aesthetics of images. Here is an image enhancement formula you can use to improve the quality of the images you generate from Midjourney. A very detailed image of subject, doing something interesting, during time of day, taken with a type of camera, using type of lens, with type of lighting. Double dash V, 5 double dash AR, 16 by 9. Let's turn it into a prompt and try it out. A very detailed image of a dragon, looking at the far end of a forest, at noon, taken with a DSLR camera, using a 70, 200mm f2.8 lens, with continuous lighting, double dash V, 5, double dash AR, 16 by 9. Here are the results. Number 2. Style Transfer Formulas The perk of this formula? is that you can apply the characteristics of one artistic style to another image. This allows for unique and visually striking outputs that blend different artistic influences seamlessly. A good example of this type of formula is style of image, painting of subject, in, setting. Let's try it out. A Japanese woodblock print of an alien with three eyes and green skin in space. Here are the results. For a second, I was wondering what the output would look like. I'm super amazed. Number 3. Image Generation Formulas Image generation formulas help you generate images automatically, based on specific parameters, like text descriptions or keywords. You have to give Midjourney a descriptive text or keyword that outlines the visual concept or scene you want. For example, a subject in the style of art, or a subject doing something action. Let's turn the formulas into prompts and try them out. A city scene in the style of cyberpunk art. A dog running through a field of flowers. Here are the results. Remember, the more precise and detailed your prompt, the more refined and accurate the generated output. Style stacking. Style stacking allows you to combine different artistic styles 
to create something unique. It's a way to break free from the usual prompts and just add a fresh flavor to your images. To give you a head start, here are three top-notch prompt examples you can try to style stack successfully. Number one, an otherworldly sunrise over a misty mountaintop. Number two, a magical forest with bioluminescent plants and hidden creatures. Number three, a retro-inspired street scene with bustling markets and old-school charm. You can experiment with layering various styles for new image outputs. Here are four top prompt examples you can explore. Number one, ethereal nature fusion. This is a blend of mystical elements with the serene charm of nature to create a dreamlike image. A good prompt example is a photorealistic painting of a waterfall made of pure light cascading down a mountainside. Number two, renaissance modernism. This is a merger between Renaissance art and contemporary design elements to generate striking compositions. For example, a photorealistic painting of a woman dressed in a Renaissance gown with a modern twist, standing in front of a cityscape that is both futuristic and classical. Notice how the prompts capture the essence of both styles. If you want to tweak the color, you can add blue or yellow before the subject. Number 3. Pop Art Extravaganza this prompt allows you to play with vibrant colors, bold patterns, and cultural references to create dynamic images that celebrate the vibrance and energy of contemporary culture. An example is a vibrant and colorful pop art extravaganza of Marilyn Monroe with bold lines, flat colors, and graphic elements. This prompt is generic, yet specific enough to guide mid-journey's output. You can switch things around by replacing the subject of Marilyn Monroe with something else. You can change the features to whimsical or even fun. Number four, cyberpunk cityscape. With this prompt, Midjourney can blend the gritty allure of cyberpunk with the dynamic energy of a bustling city to generate a futuristic image. Look at this example. A cyberpunk cityscape with cyberpunk characters like hackers, cyborgs, and neon samurais, towering skyscrapers and holographic advertisements in the style of Akira. I particularly like that one can experiment with different colors, moods, and styles with this prompt. You could ask Midjourney to generate a cyberpunk cityscape in a gloomy style, or a bright and colorful style. Notice how descriptive these prompts are. They also use specific keywords. This gives Midjourney a lot of information to work with and generates a superb image. There you have it. We hope you find these Midjourney prompts and formulas helpful. Regularly challenge yourself with new prompts and styles, incorporate different textures and patterns, and explore all of the options available. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching.